This is one of the parts for the kinetic log splitter build. So initially I designed it on paper and then brought the information to a shop that does laser cutting. So that's how that was made. And uh, so here's another part that they cut. So this one is like that one. And this one I've already cut the threads into it for bolts. So these bolt holes are a bit on the small side and I think likely that is probably how I designed it on paper. So they're a bit on the small side and then I drilled it. I drilled these out freehand and then also tapped them freehand. And I think each time I do an operation freehand like that, that can add a level of inaccuracy. So anyways, I'm going to drill these out freehand as well. But uh, I'm going to try and use a jig to uh, run the tap into the uh, holes. Maybe I can get these more square than what I did these. So this is the jig that I want to use. It's not designed for this purpose, but I think it will work. So after drilling all four of these holes a little larger, I cut the thread into these three using this jig. So I've got one more thread to cut, this one here. So I'd like to get it started first. This is the part of the video where there's not much talking. So when I thread bolts into the uh, most recently threaded plate and then back the bolt off a little bit and try and lift up on that washer and rock it at different locations, 
it feels about the same so that indicates to me that that bolt is in there square or nearly square to the plate so the others are like this as well so I think that turned out okay anyways guys thanks for checking out another video apparently somebody is wearing sandals in the shop <laughs>